Hello, everybody. My name is Jim Patterson, and I represent you up in the state capitol as part of the legislature. I uh, also was the mayor of Fresno for eight years, and I've got three children and four grandchildren. And the book I have chosen to read for you is a book that all of my grandkids have been uh, read to for a number of times, both by uh, Sharon, who's Mimi, and me, who's Papa. So I want to share with you a very special book in the Patterson House. It's No Matter What by Debbie Gliori. Are you ready to read with me? Let's go. Small was feeling grim and grumpy. Have you ever felt grim and grumpy? Well, good grief, said Large. What is the matter? I'm grim and grumpy, said Little Small. And I don't think you love me at all. Oh, Small, said Large. Grumpy or not, I'll always love you, no matter what? If I were a grumpy grizzly bear, would you still love me? Would you still care? Of course, said Large. Bear not. I'd always love you, no matter what. But if I turned into a squishy bug, would you still love me and give me a hug? What do you think? Large is going to say. Miss Large. Of course, said Large. Bug or not, I'd always love you, no matter what. No matter what, said Small with a smile. What if I were a crocodile? I'd still hold you close, snug and tight, and tuck you up in bed each night. But does love wear out? Does it break or bend? Can you fix it or patch it? Does it mend? With time together, a smile and a kiss, love can be mended with things like this. But what about when you're far away? Does your love go to, or does it stay? Look up at the stars. They're far, far away, but their light reaches us at the end of the day. It's like that with love. We may be close, we may be far away, but our love still surrounds us wherever we are and every day. That's the end of No Matter What. It's a favorite of ours. I think it's gonna be a favorite of yours. Thank you for letting me share this very special book.